Hi everyone, I'm Joanne with Newegg TV. I'm here to do an overview on these Lapau Modre Bluetooth speakers. I have three colors here with me in funky orange, electric blue, and rock and green. Before we start this unboxing, I'm gonna go ahead and take a sip out of this coffee cup. Just kidding! No, but really, a little bit about uh, the cup and the speaker before I actually take out the unit that it is inside. That is correct, there is a smaller speaker that rests inside of this uh, silicone to-go cup. So you get a cup and a speaker. That's kind of cool. Alrighty, so for some specs. It's a Bluetooth 3.0 compatible, A2DP, and I've tried it out with my phone. I'll show you in just a bit how it works. But uh, basically, you just sync it with your smartphone or device and search for the device and connect it. That's all you need to do. Um, and also, you get a transmission distance of about 10 meters or just under 38 feet, so that's quite far. And you get an output power of 3 watts, as well as you get a uh, built-in non-removable 500 milliamp 3.7 volt lithium battery. And the speaker is compatible with major Android and iOS devices. Alrighty, so let's take a closer look inside. So one moment, let me just remove this uh, blue... This is actually rubberized, by the way. Very soft rubby. And I'm going to go ahead and show you the accessories. You get, of course, a Lapel Modre user guide. And there's this little plastic piece inside that goes above the speaker. As you can see, there's this kind of uh, raised edge. And here's the actual speaker. Ta-da! It's kind of cool looking, huh? It's got this, like, elephant trunk shape to it. Should give you some good, clean, crisp sound. And there's a lapel logo. Um, and on the back, you get a USB, micro USB connector. You also get charge indicator and Bluetooth indicator. And this is an auxiliary jack. The uh, on off button is actually on the bottom right here. There you've got this ring of rubber around it. So when you set it up on a flat surface, doesn't shift around too much. And you got this uh, smooth rubberized feel to it on the outside, but I believe the inside is actually constructed of this steel layer, which is kind of nice. Um, I'll give you a closer look at uh, all of these in just a bit, but there is the speaker. And a little plastic speaker stand. What else do you get in here, eh? Ah. Let's see, you get an auxiliary cable, just in case you uh, have a smart device or just a device that is not compatible with that Bluetooth, or you just like using um, a wired connection, so you get that option too. What else do you get? You get this micro USB, a USB um, charger to charge your device. Not much to say there, but that. And let's take a look at all the other colors, shall we? So of course you get all the same stuff inside, but give me a second. Here is the yellow speaker. I'll be pairing with this one. Ah, shiny. There was a piece of plastic on the blue one, so this, this uh, rear looks much cleaner. And go ahead and take out the green one. Alrighty. Ah, look at this. It's like super bright. I love it. It's like neon. And just a little quick 360 of it. So there you have it, the three colors and a little bit about the speaker, but I'll show you how to pair in just a bit. Here's a closer look at the funky orange model. And you get 360 degree sound, as well as a built-in mic for hands-free calling, which could really come in handy and you can hear them really loudly, especially with this tiny little device. It has great uh, volume on, on there. And let's turn it this way. There you go. You get a height of 3.5 inches or 8.9 centimeters, a diameter of 2.3 inches or 5.8 centimeters, and it weighs in at only 6.35 ounces or 0.18 kilograms, whichever measurement you prefer. So it's very light, it's a very small package, um, and that means it's very portable. So that's a very good thing. I'm sure you could take it to parties and just let this l tiny little speaker be able to play the music to the volume that you want. I mean, like a small party. <laughs> but uh, let's go ahead and pair this device. So we're gonna go ahead and pair this. I'll show you a step-by-step -step process so you do not get confused. Here's the speaker itself. We're gonna go ahead and turn it on. 
power on. Did you hear that? It talks to you. How cool is that? Alrighty, now on to the setting. Settings. So make sure your Bluetooth is on. And I already connected this earlier, so just, oh, bloop. It'll said pairing or paired when it has completed. But yes, this has been connected. It shows as Lapau Modre. So here's a quick video of me building the Roswell Legacy MX2 or building inside of that case. And we're gonna go ahead and play this so you can see the volume. I mean, hear the volume and see it. So the volume bar. So I'll give it a moment to load. And right now it's on quiet. But if you make it louder, yeah. Hi everyone, I'm Joanne with Newegg TV and welcome back to yet another build, this time featuring the Rose Bowl Legacy. Alrighty, so there you have it. The pair and a little bit about how the speaker sounds. That wraps up the overview on these Lapau Modre Bluetooth speakers. I'm Joanne and if you enjoyed this video, be sure to subscribe to our New Egg YouTube channel as well as our other YouTube channels. Thanks for watching New Egg TV and we'll see you next time.